everybody welcome back to my channel my name is Naomi Amber if you're new what's good you already know what I'm about to ask so okay since that's all out the way let's just get right into this video if you're returning to my channel thank you guys so much for coming back you already know what the vibes are you already know this is the place to be so I'm so happy that you guys came back and clicked on another one of my videos but today we're going to be doing a another Pinterest recreation video this Pinterest recreation video is going to be featuring pretty little thing so all the outfits that I'm going to be recreating will all be featuring items from their website and I'm super excited because this is the second video in this series we're gonna keep it coming like I feel like these are my favorite because then I can actually make outfits out of the things that I get and I'm not just showing you guys clothes like I'm actually showing you guys how to style them and it's a little bit more fun for me because I get to like you know search and hunt for things so, if you haven't checked out my last Pinterest recreation video, I'm going to link it in the cards on the screen. That one was featuring items from Shein and I really enjoyed that one. It's going to be the same setup as last time and I'm going to rate the outfits from a 1 to 10 on how good I recreated the outfit, like if I nailed it or not. We're going to see. So I'm going to use my phone for reference for the photo so that way I can show you guys the different items and what's going on the first outfit that i have is the one that i have on right now in this picture she has a black headband i don't have a black headband but she has white glasses a white turtleneck a oversized black sweater with like some white writing on it and she has on a it looks like a tennis skirt and a canvas tote bag and white high knee socks and black heels and this this outfit is really, really out of my comfort zone. Like, it's not something that I would typically wear. I don't think I'm that girl to be wearing that kind of outfit. But I really gravitated towards it. And I was like, ooh, let me try that out and see how it looks. Like, the socks and the heels were like, yeah, I've never done that before. So, let's see how good I nailed it. So, I just got this oversized sweater from Pretty Little Thing. And it just says City of Angels. And then on the side it says downtown LA it's an oversized sweater dress so I didn't actually pair the skirt with this I do have a skirt but I'll just link down below a similar skirt but I didn't wear it with the skirt I just wore it as is and I do have on the high knee socks not the heels obviously because I'm wearing this outfit for this video but in the try on portion you guys will see the fit and here is it side by side and I'm gonna give this I'm gonna give this a 7. I'm gonna give it a 7. 6.5 because I don't have the skirt. I don't have the brown canvas tote. I was gonna get one from Pretty Little Thing, but I believe they sold out. So if they have it back in stock, I will link those down below. I need the necklaces. Wow. Different. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a 6.6.57 because I don't have the little skirt and I don't have the tote, but I do have the necklace, turtleneck, and the little sweater. But I still think the outfit is a vibe, so let's move on to the next bit. Guess I'm gonna keep on the necklaces. No, I do not like necklaces like that. So in this next outfit, the girl has on a brown. It looks like an oversized tee with like black writing on it um leather pants and she also has what looks like the rick martins i don't know the name for them but they look like converses but i do have converses that i'm going to pair with this and then she looks like she has a orange telvar bag i already know i got that too <laughs> so i'm going to show you guys the outfits side by side and see how like see if i see if i nailed it let's see um a pretty little thing i got this stone what they call it on the website sand okay i got this oversized t-shirt from pretty little thing and it's in a sand color there were oversized t-shirts on the website that had black writing but it was just like big and in the middle and it said pretty little thing and it was giving me very much hollister abercrombie vibes so i just decided to go with one that was plain and i'm happy that i did because now i can wear this with other outfits as well also from the pretty little thing website i got I've been trying to get my hands on some leather pants for a while um but I just got these shiny leather pants in the picture it looked like she had ones that were a little bit more muted and toned down in terms of the leather but I got these because I've been wanting some vinyl leather pants for a minute so hopefully these fit me I have not tried them on yet but we're just gonna see how it looks in the fit and like I said I already have my orange Telfar bag 
already have my orange shelf bag to go with the outfit and i'm also going to pair it with my lugged converses and let's just see this side by side let's 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 rate this if this if the leather pants don't fit me i'm gonna give it a if the leather pants don't fit me i'm gonna give it a six but if the leather pants do fit me and it looks fine i'm gonna give it a i'm gonna give it a 9.2 I'm gonna give it a 9.2 for me hitting it. I didn't hit it close because you know the little the little shirt don't got the black writing, but whatever. I think in terms of execution and getting the items that look close to the fit, chef's kiss. Like I think I did that. So let's move on to the next outfit. Basically, she's just wearing a white button down with some cargo pants, and these look like those Rick. I don't know the name of these shoes like I'm gonna figure out the name and I'm gonna put them on the screen but these Converse looking shoes and she's wearing a black corset it was literally so hard for me to find a black corset on Pretty Little Things website but I found one and hopefully this outfit looks nice but I'm actually hikey kind of scared in terms of getting the right items the only thing in this um, outfit that is from Pretty Little Thing is going to be this corset now this I'm gonna tell you right now is very cropped so I don't know how good this is going to look. We're going to see. We're going to see. We're going to finesse and we're going to see how it looks. But I also have a white button down top and I have that from H&M. But I'm going to link down one from Pretty Little Thing. And then I also have cargo pants as well. But those are from Fashion Nova. But I'm going to link similar ones from Pretty Little Thing um, down below. And I'm going to pair them with these same lunch converses that you saw in the last outfit and i'm gonna leave this rating since i have not tried it on yet i'm gonna leave it i'm gonna leave it up to the audience let's ask the audience i mean let me ask the audience once i try it on in the try on portion i'm going to edit in my rating for it um but right now i'm getting really scared comment down below what you rate this outfit i got the right i got the right idea let's move on to the next outfit. so this next outfit is really calm really cute really chill really simple the only thing that i have from this outfit that is from pretty little thing is just this cute little canvas tote i mean honestly i could wear with this outfit too but canvas totes have been really and it's just really that bohemian that bohemian vibe like i'm walking through new york getting some fruit kind of thing you know going on with the tote um and the tote just says a pretty little thing on it obviously but in this outfit the girl has on a black tote um with some ripped um jeans and a black crop top and it looks like jordans but i don't have those so we're going to substitute those for converses what is to pair this with a long sleeve crop top because honestly it's cold outside and let's just be realistic here so i paired it with a long sleeve crop top and i'll link all similar ones from pretty little thing down below as well as the ones that i'm wearing in the try on portion in terms of so i just really switched this whole outfit up and made it my own so i'm definitely going to give myself a in terms of me nailing the outfit i'm gonna give myself like a five but in terms of like switching it up and making it cute and making it me and making it fit me i'm going to give it a i'm gonna give it an eight let's give it an eight what y'all think i don't know <laughs> but let's move on to the next outfit so for the final outfit i just got this cream and i don't know if it's gonna pick up cream on camera because it's gonna look very very washed out and white but it's definitely a cream it's a cream sweater vest sweater vests have been really really in lately i don't know what's the vibe i don't know what's going on but sweater vests are really really in and i just got one in cream and i'm really excited to style this and i'm a little bit scared because i mean if it doesn't work out i'm gonna show you guys what else i had in mind but basically in the picture the girl's wearing a cream sweater vest and she's wearing a white button down similar to the white button down that i wore in the corset outfit and then she's wearing some it looks like boyfriend jeans so i have some boyfriend jeans and it looks like some cream shoes and i just have cream air force ones i don't know how good that's going to look with this outfit but we're going to see <laughs> save this number as we're going to see but if anything i'm i might switch out the sneakers for cream heels which i think might look better or maybe white heels so we'll see in the try on portion i'm gonna test out the different things that we have haven't tried it on yet but i'm gonna think i'm gonna say i'm gonna give this a seven six i'm gonna give it a six <laughs> because i don't know what it looks like i don't know this really is not my style this is not my lane so if I hit it, I hit it. But right now, before trying it on, I'm going to give myself a 6. 
I did get some more things from Pretty Little Things, so I want to show you guys, and I want to show you guys how I styled them as well um, to close off this haul. So let's just get right into those things. Also from Pretty Little Things, I got these pink boots. I don't, I don't know why I bought these. Like I saw them on the website, and I thought they would go so nice with the cream vest. So I bought them, and this is what they look like. They're like snake print, and it has like a short heel, so I know it's not going to be hard to walk in, but don't know why I got them, but I'm going to find some use for them some way, somehow. And if you want to see, just follow me on my socials, okay? So you guys can see how I style these fits and how I rock. So the next item that I have, this orange wired corset. And it has like this wiring like near the loop area. Oh, it's so, so nice. I cannot wait to wear this. Now, one thing I would suggest is sizing down. So like if you're normal size is a two, I would size down to a zero. Because um, the wiring does get a little wonky if it's like a little bit bigger. So definitely definitely would recommend that but i love this color like you guys know i usually wear well if you if you're new i'm telling you now i usually wear black and white but if y'all know y'all know i usually wear black and white so this is like really but orange looks so good on my skin honey so i'm really excited about this piece and it has like this satin oh it's just Y'all will see. Y'all will see the vibes. So the next top that I have, holding it up is not going to do it any justice. But it's just this ruched bodysuit. And it's it's this tool material. And it's so nice. A very nice going out bodysuit. And it's halter. And it cuts really low. And I love that about this. And it fits so nice. Which you guys see in the try on portion. I really have no complaints about this. Like 10 out of 10. Let's move on. The next item that I have is just this corset. And it's just in this nice mauved marbled. It's really that renaissance vibe that everybody has been giving lately. I just pair this with some jeans and some heels. And whoo, chef's kiss. I really, really do love this. And it fits so well. I got it in a size zero. I am in love. Next item I have is just this sweater and it says basketball varsity and the reason why I got it for real is because at the bottom it says Philly, Pennsylvania and I went to school in Philly so I have a little bit of an affinity to that place. So when I saw this I was like oh I have to have it and I thought I thought it would go so cute with this bag but honey it's giving so corny. Like I don't know if I'm ever going to wear this outfit but I'm going to show you guys what I come up with. I don't know. I just think that this will look better with any other bag. But I don't know. I thought I was doing something. And okay. last but certainly not least, we have a hoodie. And the reason why I got this hoodie is because on the back, it says steal his hoodie season. And if y'all know, when it gets cold outside, you be stealing hoodies and you never return them. So this is just encouragement to steal his hoodie. And I just pair this with my orange tail bar bag and I'll show you guys on this side because I just think that's such a vibe. And I'll show you guys how I styled it. Ugh, I love this hoodie so much. I'm a hoodie girl. So really really happy about that so we have come to the end of this video thank you guys so much for sticking around to the end if you have stuck around make sure you like this video make sure you comment down below what's your favorite fit and make sure you subscribe because i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys in the next one bye